Patricia Hoyt, an instructor with Survival School, and here's a tool for your survival kit today. The next time that you have a major project which involves you needing the support and cooperation of other people, bear in mind that you're dealing here with influence, and influence involves the interplay of two dynamics, trust and agreement. So what you want to ask yourself is this, does the person whose agreement I need, does this person trust me? If the person doesn't trust you, don't waste time trying to seek their agreement. Build the trust first. Everybody sits somewhere on a matrix between trust and agreement. Some people will trust you and agree with you. Other people will agree with you, but they won't trust you. Other people will disagree with you and they don't trust you. Some people might agree with you, but they really don't trust you. What's important for you is that you know more or less where people with whom you are engaged actually sit with respect to the trust agreement matrix. And the clue is always to do this. Work on trust first. Don't waste your time seeking agreement from people who don't trust you. First of all, focus on the trust. How do you do that? Build a relationship with them, spend time with them, share a story with them. When you've done that, you've found that you'll be able to work well with people who trust you and who, whether or not they agree with you, will be able to help you shape a plan that is a stronger plan that you could have ever conceived of in the first place. Mm -hmm.